Hey guys, Todd Spears here. In this video, I want to go over SERP Scanner. It's a pretty simple idea here. You just put in a keyword like plumbers in Dallas, Texas, or anything you like. Uh, pick what pages you want to you want to scan. Either the first page, the first few pages, or you don't want to select the first page. You just want to select page two, three, four. That's fine. Or however you want to do it here. Uh, for instance, I searched for emergency AC repair in Phoenix. I found 23 websites and I searched pages two through four. This was done about 10 days ago. And I've done a lot of other ones here as well. Load these results. Uh, you can put in anything in the search box here to search the title and description. Maybe I just want to find the ones with emergency in this title and description to so make sure that's exactly what I'm going for. So I came back with two uh, right here. You can see emergency. So that's what this search right here does. Uh, let me bring them all back up. Now if I'm going to use the campaign, the email campaign, I want to only look for ones with email so I can select that. Uh, if I want to find the ones that don't have an SSL, I double click. Everything looks good on those. So let me go with no Facebook pixel. There's the ones with. There's the ones without. So all of these actually don't have Facebook pixels. So if I want to target these companies because they're not using Facebook retargeting, then that's also a great uh, foot in the door strategy. So you can do whatever you want here with these. These are the ones with schema. These are the ones without schema right here, red and red. So this, this is sort of searchable or sortable, excuse me, SSL who does not have an SSL. Looks like they all do. So you can kind of go from there and figure out which ones you want. Uh, if you find some that you want to work with, say, let's say we're just going after the ones with face without a Facebook pixel. So now we can also we can also select all of these right here. All right. Selected them all. Boom, 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 boom. Now we can send them all to deep analysis by clicking this button right here. It's going to tell me it's going to cost me 27 credits because we're doing a deep analysis on all of those pages. You can do that if you want, or if you just want to uh, select a couple of these, then that's fine to send a deep analysis. You can do whatever you want. If you want to just export all this data, you can just click export and then you can sort of select how you want to do that. Uh, remove any, you can check box and remove any of them that you want. Um, and you, whenever you get ready, you can send them an email. So let's go ahead and select a couple of these right here. Well, you know what? We'll say that for another video. We're going to keep these in bite-sized chunks. But basically, that is it on the SERP scanner. Uh, you can see what position they're in. This guy's in position 14, 15, 16, 19. And that is for this exact keyword right here. Okay, this is where they're ranking for that keyword. Also, if you see one of these URLs and they're like a directory or they're Yelp or they're you know, something that you do, you really don't ever want to see again in this market. You can, or this search, you can flag it and then it'll go to an admin area and then we will review that and confirm whether or not we will remove that and it won't ever include that in your results anymore. Um, another thing that you want to look for over here is all of the contact um, information. We have email, phone, uh, Facebook page and contact page. Like for instance, if, if, if so, if this, if you really wanted to contact this customer and it didn't have any of these three, you could simply go to its contact page and hit them up right through here. If that's what you wanted to do or look even as a messenger. So you can do a couple things that way. And that's basically it on the search scanner. Let me see if I forgot anything else. No, that's the simplicity of the search scanner and it does just scrape Google.